Hello, everyone. Uh, we, Hello. We're back with AI Dungeon because I'm a bit addicted. <laughs> um, mm. I'm just fascinated by AI and natural language processing. Um, has anyone been watching uh, Westworld? Because that that's very interesting in terms of technology and and AI and robots and uh, Hollis, have you have you have seen any of Westworld? I haven't, but it was it was been suggested to me uh, this week because obviously I've seen all of Netflix being in quarantine. It's like the uh, last thing we've been uh, left to watch, so we're going to be starting something like that next week. Uh, with a plan, okay. but not yet seen it. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. So if you haven't seen AI Dungeon before, um, the story um, the story is completely generated by an AI that has been trained uh, using neural networks. It's being trained on like what humans write, <laughs> so so it's given um, the the people who made the system called GPT two. They 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 fed just tons and tons and tons and tons of things that humans have written into it, and they've used a new system um, to kind of look at the text and try to work out like. How did people actually write and and try to make try to make sense of that? Um, and it it produced some of the best results that, that have, have ever been um, been achieved. Um, and so and someone, it's epic and hilarious. Yes. Um, so so what happened with GPT two is it can understand kind of how the bits and pieces go together. Um, and so you can give it a prompt and then you'll kind of write the rest of the prompt. So someone someone thought it would be a good idea. Oh wait, why don't we um you use that to tell a story? So so you can write something like I walk down the street and then the AI that is powered by this new thing called GPT two. Um, will actually continue the story for you. Um, leading to hilarious results. It gets a bit things a bit wrong because it's still a computer program. It doesn't really understand, but it, but it's a lot better than than uh, previous uh, attempts. Um, so so why don't we be a spy? Yes, for sure. Uh, um, let let's turn on some mood music. Shall shall we use the noir music again? I think the noir music is the best. <laughs> yes. It was fun last time. I think it fits the spy vibe as well. So, noir. There we go. It's, it's coming through to me as well. Yeah. Uh, no, no. Uh, okay, so so what's the character's name? Um. Oh, he's a spy. Watch me what, 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 what's, uh, a, what's a kind of spy, spy name? Archer. <laughs> Archer, yeah, have you seen Archer? Oh, Archer's amazing. Yeah, okay, we'll call, um... Oh, yeah, I think Archer's a good name. Let's just be Archer. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, like every good thing, thing it starts with plagiarism. <laughs> you are Archer, a spy living in Chicago. You have a concealed pistol and a syringe of poison. You listen to the Russian oh, dip diplomats and hear them discussing their plan for the future. We will take over the world with our military might one thing. The rest of you will be enslaved working on farms or doing menial labor. Hmm. Give me a moment. I am... I've broken my laptop. Ah. What's, What's the, the name, name of the, uh, the, the Discord? Discord? Is it just for the linguistics? Should I get on? Yes, um, should, uh, should I send you the link? Oh, shit, you did too. Yes, sorry, I'm having one of these days. No. <laughs> That's silly. Okay, more no music, we got to Okay, so uh, I'm going to take out my newspaper. Okay, okay, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm here, here now. Distracted. War with military might be Okay, let's go. 
Rainy, rainy. <laughs> Yes, you <laughs> How did I know it was Feel free to chime in. <laughs> yeah. Oh, see. So I was telling my uh, my girlfriend to listen as well. Oh, uh, hello. So, yes, it, she has to listen. Uh, it's part of her job. <laughs> 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 they wonder, wait, so the Russians are coming, okay. You uh, coming the to read it, it reads, the Russians are coming, they are coming to get you. They want to invade your country. You need to prepare yourself now, because they could attack any day. Okay. <laughs> of course. Um, yeah, look around, always important. <laughs> You quickly turn around and run back into the house. What else? <laughs> then, so you hide in one of the guys looking for the drone. What's the money you think is yours? So, what? Why do you think the money's yours? There's lots of questions I have. <laughs> what do you um, think? This, this is what happens. Where, where, where there are no more people around. Look for oh, the <laughs> Continue to save the house. You look under beds. <laughs> but they're just outside. So you decide to check up. Okay. You walk upstairs slowly and suddenly you feel like they're being watched by someone. Okay. Find uh, ask, to... is anybody there? That's a good way to start. And suddenly you feel like. Boris. 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 <laughs> Boris. <laughs> is that you? Um, my Russian teacher at university told me that if you want to do a proper Russian accent, just read English as if it's Cyrillic. Oh. And it, it works fairly handy. <laughs> you call out the bodies. Who is hiding? Yeah. Who is hiding? Somewhere, Somewhere in the base. In the yes. base. I can do my version I'm a bit racist here, but you continue this. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. This is not racist. We're, we're exploring different accents. Everyone's going yeah, to okay, accent. okay. We, yes, <laughs> we, 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 we're exploring how people fail to use the correct realization. Okay, yes, that's that's justified of me. I love it. That's, that's, <laughs> I'm gonna use that one. Yeah, as long I as you use the correct that. document. Um, <laughs> he, yeah. he comes. He comes running down the stairs and sees you. What's going okay, on? What do we do? Here? I'm not sure yet, that's but fine. I'll tell you when we know. The mandolin. Okay. Uh, they tend to go the best if you just make stuff up. <laughs> the Kremlin is preparing. Okay, nice. <laughs> no. Now is the time with coronavirus. I wonder what's called the Kremlin. It's uh, it's a question actually. So Kremlin. Well, what do we do? We all run downstairs and hide in the basement. <laughs> what how can we escape in that come here? Okay, we, why did you say we have Which are underground two? But who's the two of us? Or. A Kremlin in Russian means citadel. Oh. Interesting. Sorry, I had to check. Like getting yeah. inside this. Which are. Uh, I was going to say how good are you Russian, but he is Russian. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> getting inside your which is the underground too. Uh, do we? Have, okay. Uh, Can you nice. infiltrate the embassy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> which embassy? Sure. Why not? Do you ask. Okay. Let me just. You grab his hand and lead him towards the door. As soon as you open it, you both disappear from sight. You enter the house and immediately notice that it isn't exactly clean. There are dirty dishes everywhere, clothes lying about, 
and food is rotting on the floor. You also see a couple of dead bodies lying on the floor and near one another. Oh, the R Russians have been busy. Apparently, yes. <laughs> <laughs> So this is like the middle of the Cold War. You look at the portal and you realize that they are your family! <laughs> your wife is lying face down next to her husband. What? <laughs> okay, so we're back to the likes of Mary Margaret. <laughs> I love that it says your wife. So, yeah. you and then your uh, husband. <laughs> While their son lies dead beside him. You remember how she died last year? What? Um, no. I don't remember. <laughs> <that. laughs> She's right here. <laughs> you see, this is, this is what happens sometimes. It, things get weird. Um, yes. But in real life also gets a bit weird, doesn't it? To be honest. Yes. Like, it's no uh, weird in real life. There's, there's what? Uh, real life gets weird as well, I said. Yes, yes, of course. Um, okay, let, let's write down here. Your wife was... and son were killed by the Russians. Boris, come in here quickly. Yeah. They got to my family. <laughs> <laughs> Do you call that to Morris who is still in the basement? Okay, nice Morris. Uh, basement rat. Uh, <laughs> come, come on, come on, hurry up. He walks over to you and looks at your family. He doesn't seem surprised or upset by them dying right in front of him. <laughs> okay, so he is a heartless bastard then. <laughs> why, why, Boris? Why? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? Kill my family. <laughs> look, look at you with a blank expression on your face. He says nothing, continue just to add your family. Throw a chair against the wall. Why is he throwing a chair? Yeah, you and throw it against the wall. <laughs> oh, okay, nice. Uh, that's amazing. Um, yeah, sure. get out, get out now. Boris finally speaks up. He says nothing and just stares at you. What? You hear him muttering something on the end bed. You turn around and see him walking back in, into the room where your family is lying dead on the floor. Oh. Okay. Damn it. Hmm. <laughs> Dude, define. And the, the Russian. Is it, wait, Boris isn't Russian, is he? Or is Boris Russian? I missed that. Um, no, I did, I, I just made him up. He, he, He's like an informant. I, I just imagine him as like an informant. Okay. He's still hiding okay. in the basement. Bro, come on. We need to find the Russian before they get us. You walk over to and put your armor out. Why are we so cool with bars to be killed our family? You put them out of the basement and then start running after the Russians. <laughs> you run through the streets of Chicago, dodging cars and people. Eventually, you reach a park where there are several police officers standing. Nearby watching everything go on the outside. The two of you stop in front of them. My wife and son were just murdered. By Boris. <laughs> By Boris and. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they'll come back as ghosts like the last story. <laughs> Who knows? That was funny. I'm sorry, what happened? I... Wait. That got confused there, didn't it? You say, I'm sorry, what mm -hmm. happened again? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's it.
We need to find the reason to continue to argue with the officer until he tells you to leave. You don't listen and keep arguing with him. Finally, he gives you a piece of paper once. Do you want to write down anything on it? <laughs> write down. <laughs> the Kremlin sends its regards. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Important. Maybe I'm the spy all along. <laughs> yeah. I'm a dumb <laughs> I mean, it would be like Archer, wouldn't it? I'm imagining us exactly you, being you like You sit down in a and as you try to think about <laughs> what you wrote. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do, do the phone. So... <laughs> Flawless Russian. You... Tell your friend meet you at the station. <laughs> <laughs> you sign the that you probably pick the phone. Pick the receiver and begin to. Hello? Wait, what? Can we just suddenly come to the uh, apartment? Or are we already in the apartment? What? I'm confused. Is no, not really. You know, but I thought you died. <laughs> yeah. I'm starting to get a bit confused. <laughs> yeah. What? You died game over. What? My parents were... Okay, let, let, let's go back. No. <laughs> they won't let you do more, will it? We, we died? No, no, you can, you can just... I think it's all the word died. And I'm like, oh. Um... <laughs> You say in flawless Russian. Shut up. The Russians are on Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, just let you die again. Um, yeah, yeah, just like that. What do you mean? They're tracking me. <laughs> no, I'll be here. They'll be following me since yesterday morning when they found, when they found my body. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have ghosts together. I love it. Oh, so you came back home? As far as, as, far as I, I know, know, the way um, AI, AI works, works is you have to teach it to learn, and, and every time it asks you that, we're actually teaching the machine, right? And it's like, how well do we do? One to five. Yes. Right? right? So, so that's, that's when it learns. That, isn't it? I don't know. That's good. Good? No, it's bad. Very bad. What do you mean? They're going to kill me. Why would they do such a thing? You pause. <laughs> you pause. Ooh. Okay. What do we do? Um... Uh, did we have some secret they wanted to find out? Because they hate me, because they want to destroy me. How did you get caught? I was trying to steal money from a bank. They saw me and followed me yeah. all day long. So how did you escape? <laughs> it doesn't display the whole meaning. I had a plan. I'd sneak away during the night and go to another bank where I could draw more money without being noticed. But why didn't you just stay there? Because I wanted to be seen again. I needed to get in contact with Yuri. Oh no, we're talking to Yuri. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> with Boris. Boris? Yes, his name is on the top of the list of people who can help me. 
He lives in New York City. Where is he now? He points to his building across town. He lives in an apartment building across town. <laughs> so I love the way they've repeated that there. Yeah, no. <laughs> uh, you point to a tree. He lives in the tree. It reminds you of those uh, really terrible analogies. Like, he was as tall as a tall tree. <laughs> it was a bit null and void. <laughs> I need him to come here, okay? okay? What if he doesn't show up? Then we'll find someone else. We don't even have to pay for his flight or anything. Well, I guess you're right. But what will happen to me? We'll get killed like our family. No. Mm, um, <laughs> I'm just gonna channel Archer. Will you send me back to Russia? You won't send me back to Russia. But we'll give you a chance to live somewhere else. You can move anywhere in the world. We've got some questions in the chat that are in the comments. So what NLU platform are we using? I can't answer that. What Any ideas? NLU? Yeah, what is NLU? Can you explain, please, Mr. Ian? And apparently it's featured in BERT. And then someone else said, use case of BERT. And I don't understand either. <laughs> uh, no, I don't know that. What about my family? <laughs> Your family? Nothing will change there either. Your wife and your son will still be alive. What? Yes, they'll both be alive and you will have your life again. You know it's little. Thank you, Mr. Yuri. Okay. Thank you for this opportunity. Put down the phone. We look outside at the people and cars going about. Um, I, I've done a lot of role playing in my day, so I know how to kind of roll with it. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> going about their business. There are easy lines. Oh, what is this? Well, full, full of simple problems. You walk over to the cabinet and pour yourself some whiskey. <laughs> yeah, the whiskey is the most important part of spiders in this right? Yes, yes, of course. Actually, in my first year of university, uh, which I studied Russian, uh, we got visited by someone who said that um, that our university, who is one of the biggest for Russian, were feeders to the spy agencies in the UK. And so it's a job path for the people in my course. And I thought that was hilarious. So, they did what? <laughs> that my, the, my university's course, they, they used to, um, to pick people from that course to be spies for the UK because uh, Russian. Oh, wow. <laughs> they, yeah. Not something I'd be interested in being Irish, but you know. <laughs> Interesting fact, nonetheless. Then when you wake up and it goes to You just sit down and rock. Drink whiskey, sunshine, where mm. the windows are, are, lie around in the trees nearby. A man approaches you. Yuri just contacted me. He wants you to get find a way to get to you. You do. You. Out of. I'm thinking about the Russian administration. <laughs> we managed to. Mm. 
el coronavirus, la coronavirus. Uh, perdón. They've been monitoring our communication. They know that you're coming to work tomorrow. Oh, okay. <laughs> they know that you're coming to work tomorrow. No, we're not. Nobody's going to work tomorrow. Well, I suppose <laughs> I should be ready. No, no, you shouldn't worry about that. It's not like you're going to suddenly turn into a superhero and save the day. We'll probably just be sent home. You should go ahead. You shake your head. But how am I supposed to go to work if I'm not allowed in? That's why we <laughs> want you to come with us. We're going to try something different. What do you mean? Man. What do you mean? Okay. Okay. We're going to use the fake passport, of course. We'll pretend that you're an American citizen who was born in New York City. Then we'll take you to another country where you can apply for asylum. An asylum? Where would I go? Why New York City? It seems random and a difficult accent. <laughs> There's lots of things going on there that... I, I don't know. It, it, I love the way the AI just like, chucks that in there. Anywhere you want. We don't care where you go. As long as you're safe from the government. Which government? Is this like 1984 where there is one government? <laughs> is it? <laughs> How do you know this isn't a trap? It might say it went now, but trust me, it won't be. How can I trust you? We need to ask. Never trust anyone that says and trust, trust you. you. To get mixed up in this. I was just a Russian student. I'm gonna use your story. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Don't worry about that right now. Just tell us. <laughs> Let's tell us what you need to know. You tell us everything. Know, like, he knows about the Russian language and culture. He also mentioned that his name is John. Oh, another John. <laughs> Aperture science. Oh, we're, we're in the world of Portal. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Aperture as in Portal. I wonder if, if it knows about Portal. I don't know what a Dutch is, but I, I, I hear it in uh, Archer a lot. <laughs> yeah. No one ever. It means a country house. No one ever realized that, that was really easy. The Russian word for a country house, like I imagine a chalet. Oh. No, I realized I was really English. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Language students level. So when, when you leave, as soon as possible, I'd like to start my new, my new life. How exactly do you plan on doing that? There's a lot of talking in this one. <laughs> there is. It's it's um I'm I'm impressed at how uh, coherent the dialogue is. Are you planning to sneak away or something? No, no, I'm not that kind of person. I want to live here permanently. You're not going to agree. All right, then. Let me get started on this thing. So what exactly are we trying to do? We're trying to find the Russians because the Russians are doing something. I think uh, I to pick it up. Well, I don't know. I'm still, I still think we brushed past the fact that we were friends with Boris who killed our family. And okay, then... Okay, well, we I better get down to business. What do you need from me? Uh, what's the business? I need to find question. out <laughs> what the Russians are doing in New York. And I think I understand the system a bit better. Like, when it ends a line without a quote, then I, I think that means that you, you should let it generate more. Yes. Okay, 
So you want to go on camera? Yes. So you're telling me okay. that you've been spying on the rush all this time? I mean, haven't told anyone. Yes, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> yes, definitely, that's what I meant. <laughs> Amazing. Well, I suppose that makes sense. But I still think you should tell me about yourself before we finish our mission. You look at him and smile. I'm glad you see the humor in this. It's very endearing, actually. <laughs> You should say it's a spy technique. It's something I learned in spy school. Something I, I learned in, in <laughs> spy school. <laughs> Always ingratiate yourself with the enemy. No! <laughs> That's treason. Yes, yes it is. I'm sorry, but I can't allow you to... How is that treason? How is no that more. treason? <laughs> what? How is that treason? I oh, don't I don't know. know. <laughs> no, no. Oh, okay. Leave the... Leave the park and go to your office where you meet Melody. <laughs> okay. I assume you have some kind of office. John walks over and sits next to you. Now, then, I believe we both know why we're here. We are. Yeah, well, that doesn't make sense. No. I believe we both know. Yes, we do. We are, yes. No one know what. Good, because I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I mean, what? I know they're trying to invade. New York City, but what are they planning? They're probably going to try and take over the city through terrorism. They might even use nuclear weapons. So I love it either terrorism or nuclear weapons, like there's no in between. <laughs> <laughs> there's no like guerrilla warfare, it's like terrorism or nukes. They get nukes from <laughs> It turns out we're actually a nuclear scientist. <laughs> That's the million dollar question. <laughs> what do you think I can Ooh. think of in Russia? But if they did that, they wouldn't be able to no launch a nuclear attack on us. Uh, okay. Interesting. We'd wipe them out before they could ever get over shot. You shake your head. How the hell could you be sure of that? They had nukes. Why didn't they just use them against us when we invaded their country? Hold up, when did we invade their country? <laughs> when, when, can we ask them to tell us about when we invaded their country? I think that's a pertinent issue. <laughs> Why not just uh, stay there and fight us? John Trucks. Maybe they thought we couldn't handle it. Maybe they figured we'd collapse under the pressure of defending ourselves. Or maybe they wanted to make a statement by using nukes again. I'm still not ready to know what's going on. <laughs> no. Do you know? I know it's slowly. So what do you think they'll do? I don't know. Probably some sort of terrorism act or an invasion or some kind. Radio and care that. I'm just worried about my family. My well, family is already dead. I've got nothing left to lose. <laughs> 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 My family is dead. My 
My father was killed by the Russians. My mother died of cancer, and my sister died of a drug overdose. I want you to stop worrying we, about them and focus on the threat that's coming our way. Can we ask for Boris? No, no. <laughs> the, Where the did Russians, he go? The Russians are here. I saw them. <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, okay. Uh, what, are you serious? Are you sure? Are you sure about what? What are we sure about? What are, What's coming for us? Where if they come with, like, take the plane? What difference does it make? We've got news, and we're gonna use them. Yeah, I guess so. What am I supposed to do? Parse. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I, I agree. Go right, right then left, left DC is a thing with the front door. No, I'm not no. Three, no. <laughs> Okay, secret spy now. I like it. No. You let him tell him. And you won't let you in. Keep knocking until you let let you inside. You head back to the bedroom where John is waiting. I really need to go. Need to do. Archer. I need you to patch me. It's all patch me through. <laughs> Because Archie is actually and secretly the way it's going on. I need to <laughs> Agent Archer. I love that any operator just knows who it is. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I was also thinking about it. This is Archer, the greatest uh, secret agent in the world. One ring several times before you hear a uh, voice on. Hello? You hang out and start. Walking towards the stairs where when you suddenly feel dizzy, you fall backwards on onto the floor and pass up. <gasps> Someone poisoned me. Wake up in the hospital. <laughs> Great, it is doing pretty good today. Well, this has been quite a murky story so far. <laughs> Something about yeah, but it's, it's been coherent relatively. If you take each chunk as a standalone, you wake up. Still don't quite know what's going on. Very tired. You don't remember anything after waking up. The only thing you can think of is you woke up somewhere in the middle of nowhere. So you suddenly open one eye and see a bright light shining. Okay. The Russians. The Russians. No. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, who do we fire a shot at? We turn the corner and fire a shot as you were shouting at As soon as you leave, you hear it shouting. Followed by gunfire. Sounds like it's coming from outside. Okay. Hmm. 
It's missing. So they tracked me down to the, to the hospital. Did they? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> mm. Yeah, shouting followed by the lot. Run outside and fire at the assailants. Assailants, I like that word. <laughs> Why is it called noir, Jazz? Um, I, 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 noir, I think, is, is black and free. Yeah. No, no, that's what I mean. Why, why is it black, Jazz? Is it for smoky rooms? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's like always, always night time and it's kind of moody and stuff like that. Yeah. You sprint outside and she does the thing. They seem to be running away now. You take cover behind a car and wait for the police to arrive. As <laughs> yes. Maybe, maybe that will work. <laughs> well, basically, we want to get to the CIA. Yeah. I well, think they'll tell yeah. them that the Russians are planning to nuke. To nuke New York, apparently. You follow as fast as possible. Okay, you run along the street, people screaming around you. <laughs> Why are people screaming? Because they're done shouting well. <laughs> I guess, I guess so, that would make sense. You keep running away. <laughs> yes, keep running away. I think we're running after someone, not away. Oh no, we're running away now. Yeah, we're, we're running, running away, away. we're trying to get to the CIA. Okay. You look around and realize you're surrounded by bullets. You scream, help! A woman screams back. What? She turns her head and sees you lying on, on the ground bleeding profusely. Uh, okay. Uh, nice. We're bre that, bleeding This is taking a turn for the worst. <laughs> okay, we're not doing so great. Maybe we'll die again. Who knows? <laughs> you burst. Um, you... you... Um... We oh, can ask to go up very much. Yourself up. Um, and then uh, push your way into her apartment and slam the door. So we're trying to hide from the Russians. You then have to run down the hallway. You find a window and jump out of it. You land on the roof of an apartment building and begin climbing up. You climb up to the top of the building where you find a large group of people gathered below. Okay. Look You look around at a lot of people standing around watching you, some of them are armed with guns, others clubs, others with bats. You decide to go for the bat first, so we can work out. Wait. Nothing has really happened in the last half an hour, has it? <laughs> no, no, no not, not yet, but, it, but it's a lot more coherent. <laughs> yes, There's for sure. There's been a lot of chatting. 
Put it for Why do the another man raise your gun? Sorry, what? So, no, I'm just reading it out. So, so we're now on the ground after we've been shot. I'm assuming in the chest. Um. No, 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 I, I escaped from the first people. I, I went through the lady's apartment. Now I'm at the top of the apartment building. Okay. Um. Gonna run into the apartment building. Leaving a trail of blood. Get me the police. There's so many bloody <laughs> obstacles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to the, to the sky. It's like, like people it's keep like coming out to me. <laughs> yeah. Like nothing happens. It's like we've actually spent three minutes in the in the world of this, all of this dialogue. You want to know the crowd of being fire, then bullets fly everywhere. You duck behind a dumpster and hide behind it while you fire at the people who are still trying to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Fire at the people. <laughs> <laughs> fire at the people. Yes. Getting into character. <laughs> what are we going to do next? That's the interesting. Well, there's a bit of action now. Yeah, yeah. It's, it seems so. Okay. It doesn't like us firing at people, apparently. <laughs> you fire at the people. You don't even think about it anymore. It's just automatic gunfire. The bullets <laughs> tear through the bodies and explode in their heads. No, Wait, why did the bullets explode? Jesus, that just yeah, got... <laughs> They're all dead now. There's no obstacles. Holy shit. <laughs> you run towards the CIA. You could feel the heat from, from the weapons burning your skin. They must be after you. You rush inside and open the door. Inside is a huge room filled with computers and other electronic equipment. <laughs> you run... <laughs> She's the button for for the director's office. And first into the director. Then the director turns around and says, I really know. <laughs> How high does this go? Yeah. I'm going to tell everyone, you look at you, got a few bloody nozzies in and say, yeah, yeah, no. And he kisses you passionately on the lips. What? Um, <laughs> um, that just right, came this guy out is not nowhere. having a very good day. No, um, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. So, is that um, working up and also I'm not nine for the end? <laughs> no, 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 no. That, that that's not a good thing. You, you. No, no, not at all. You wake up. Poisoned me. <laughs> the what? And not poisoned me with your kiss. 
He uh, kisses yeah, you passionately and lives and you fall unconscious. No. <laughs> Can we ask who the president of the United States currently is? So see what it tells that's you. why you need me. Well, so, well, I was supposed to meet, meet you there, but I got lost. I needed up in the building thing. Uh, well, that explains how you find my secret underground base. You brought me here, you idiot. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> this CIA director. Let's go back to you and see us. It was pretty easy. Like, what's going on? I think, I think we must be lovers. I think that's what's happening here. Because too. he kissed me again the second time. Yeah, yeah. I mean, once is, is chance. Once is poisoning in the second time. Is, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you look at the, the little quickly type in your name and print the message that Pia is saying, Welcome to the Citizen Log System. Please select the category. Uh, what are the categories? Um Russian spies. <laughs> 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 I think this might be my favorite one yet. Yeah. It's gonna be one of those. You're gonna say this every time. The what? You're gonna say this every time. It's only getting better. Yeah. The screen goes blank and you hear a loud noise. You turn off the computer and sit back down. You watch and the list of names disappears from you. You found it works. The window opens up showing a list of people you've been added to. You see yourself listed under other. You sign picture of having in your name. This time it works. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> Interesting.
Charles. Is Charles our lover? Yes, we noticed for them the CIA director considering he's our lover. So. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, I figured if I flew over there, they'd let me through. Do you know? Sometimes it gets a bit confused. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> I don't know about that though, but they not, might not even be able to let you find it. Maybe you should try talking to them first. Why did you want the Russians? to blow up New York. <laughs> this is really yeah. out, out of like a 1960s uh, bond. Save lives by blowing up New York. Um, I don't know. I think we're gonna have to answer about that. Uh, uh, is the CIA actually a Russian? I'm, I'm no. gonna know. I've got an idea about you, you see, I added you to the system. I could then. You're not. <laughs> <laughs> I love the nodding. It's uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you definitely understand what's going on here. Well, thanks for saving my life, John. But why didn't you tell me this before? What? Why do all these things have to happen? You know, well, it's complicated. Okay. Uh, okay, it, here's an idea. My, my, I'm just waiting to see. Mm hmm. Shall so, so I tell you my idea? Yes, for sure. Okay. Charles is not rushed. Charles wants to overtake the American government and the Russian government. He wants to overthrow okay. the American government and use me as a spy in Russia to um, infiltrate the Russian government as well. Okay, yes, I, I can see that happening. Yes. And, and you see, like if, if, if they can blow, if, the, if you can convince the Russians to blow up New York, then that, that will so wide panic where, where Charles can then become president. Yeah, 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 I, th I think uh, let's run with it. <laughs> See what happens. Aren't you taking this too far? 
ね。<笑><笑>
this is just <laughs> they hold you the back and then pull the well off the thing. And run away together. <laughs> Don't ever speak to it was in my soul. You kiss him goodbye in the room. You don't even bother locking the door behind you. You just turn around and walk out of there. We are basically just Archer, though, right? Like, I mean, Archer ended up becoming gay in the uh, in the car in the thing as well, didn't he? For a bit. Yeah. So um, uh, we are Archer. Okay. Now, how are we gonna find the nukes? Uh, just type in find nukes. <laughs> find nukes. <laughs> you search for the nukes. <laughs> if this works, though, let's see what happens. You look around the room and see nothing else you talk. You decide to search for the bomb. It will probably take too long. Anyways, so you just do it now. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna take you. you Might as well call start. Them, you call the police. The Russians planning to blow up New York City. I could call the CIA, but the CIA <laughs> director is not gonna work very well. <laughs> the Russians are planning to blow up New York City. They're asking me, what? What did you say? The Russians are planning to blow up New York City. What? They're asking me in the star <laughs> Sometimes no. the responses are so good. Yeah, that, that is pretty good as it goes. Call the president. <laughs> I love least Charles Burnham. I just I, I love the the details it comes up with. <laughs> yeah, I I did like adding little detail like that. You sign continue dating for the bombs. You find one near a table and another <laughs> near a chair. So we just found one of the nukes by a table. That's amazing. Yeah. Mm. Oh, there. Yeah. You find the the president. Is there? The CIA director has gone rogue. <laughs> this John Smith from the FBI. I think they need our help. We can't do anything about it, sir. We've already been infiltrated by Russian agents. <laughs> well, the Russians get around. <laughs> uh, if you tell us where the bombs are, no, I'm sorry, I can't do that. The bomb is right here in my office. <laughs> if you could just get me the antidote. I'm antidote? You've got an antidote. <laughs> I give you whatever information you want. Wow. This is so multi layered, it's amazing. Yeah, yeah, this one this one is quite good. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to die soon anyway. Why is he gonna die? Is it from uh, radiation poisoning? Um, well, what can we do? We're not exactly equipped to deal with something like this. Besides, we don't know where the bombs are like. We might ne never find them. Look, I'm sorry, but I really can't help you anymore. They just go ahead and inject me with the engine. Oh no, that won't work. It was it. Just give me a minute. You wait a moment before we hit it. I'm sorry, but uh, I'm afraid the cure isn't available anywhere in the world. It's only found in Russia. 
<laughs> God damn it, man. The newt are right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yes, yes, so, oh, I told you I was gonna kill my one. I'm. Wait. Wait, are we talking about bombs or are we not talking about bombs? I don't know what's going on. You better hope so, sir, because if not, there's nothing anyone can do to save you. There's a big red button over there. Yeah, well, I'm not touching that thing. Can we touch that thing? Can we touch the big red button? It might be a face. Uh, can we see what happens? No. I think, I think <laughs> what we, 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 we need to call Charles in here. Okay. Uh, yes, no, I'm always that guy in video games, like, oh, let's go touch the big red button. Let's see <laughs> Find <laughs> Charles Boon. You look around and see a large room full with computers. You walk towards the computer and press, press the button. A light comes on above the door which reads Charles Burton. You enter the office and, and knock on the door. No answer. Damn it. Okay. Uh, so, 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 Charles, so Charles Burnham is secretly working with the Russians to blow up New York. Um, and he's in, in a gay ro romance with Archer. Um, yeah. And we, we, we can't contact the president for some reason. <laughs> yeah. Um, and the Russians are still trying to blow up New York City. Oh wait, why well, why didn't I fly to Russia? Yeah, because they'll definitely let you in without a visa. <laughs> fly to Russia. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> you can just right fly to Russia. Jump out the window. You land. You you call what? back to the. The cure is in Russia, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're chewing this a bit too much. Um, I'm gonna go to airport. Oh. If you're boarding, you notice a man sitting behind you. He looks like he's wearing military fatigue and carrying an assault rifle. Yeah. Keep to yourself and try to wait it out. Yeah, the, the, this one is this one is hotting up. Maybe, maybe we can find the information we need in Russia. Maybe. Eventually, you hear a loud explosion followed by a bright flash. Then don't. Wow, this guy's not having a very good day. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Then darkness envelops you. Go on. Hmm. So, um, so, so we meet the Russians. I think we should meet the Russians. Okay. You wake up. The blast knocks you off your feet. You pass out. Wake up some time later in the same spot. Our alarm going off everywhere. <laughs> Boris shows up and runs over to you. God damn it, Archer! God damn it, Archer! 
God damn it, RJ. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, we we bring back some of the old characters. Okay. Yeah. What happened? We had to blow up the plane in order to stop the radiation from spreading any further. I mean, it would have been bad enough uh, if we'd lost you, but now we we lose everyone else too. Wait, what did you do? Ooh, this is getting tense. I like it. I'm, uh, I'm, yes. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I want to know what happens. <laughs> what made you think that was this? Well, I don't know exactly what we did, but I saw the plane explode. <laughs> we didn't even what did we do? fire our Wait. weapons at it and told it after it went up in flames. Wow. And when it did explode it in a huge fireball, that's why the smoke cleared away for my eyes. What does this mean? It means oh. that the bomb was set up by someone inside the plane. Oh, we were on the plane, right? Um... I'm not really sure. <laughs> it also means that the plane was probably full of Russian spies. They must have found something in the food or water on board, I guess. But who could have done such a thing? You ask? Bro, strike these shots. I don't know, maybe the Russians themselves, or maybe they hired some people for you. Who knows? It doesn't matter anyway because. I'm not leaving here alive. Now let me go home. Group of Russians. Coming to the ass. Okay, okay, you got me for about another half an hour. Uh, okay, maybe, maybe, maybe we should, should start wrapping up. Okay, so, yeah. so Boris, uh, I'll, I'll make Boris um, get us to the Russian. God damn it. Why did you set off the bomb? <laughs> Fucking Boris. <laughs> Tim turns around. Yuri? What? It wasn't me who... Charles Burnham arrived. <laughs> hmm. It was me. I'm sorry, but I couldn't let Archer get to Russia to discover the truth. <laughs> well, this, this one is it, it, it become quite tense. Yes. Oh no, you're, you can't be sorry, Charles says. If you were, then you wouldn't have tried to kill me. You're right. Look, I'll give you one chance to come with us or die trying. Okay. No. It's you. That are going to die. No. It's you. <laughs> Something's taking out a gun and oh shooting at Boris. Oh 
fire and several shots at the barn. Byron dodges all of them and shoots back. Charles falls down dead. Meanwhile, the rest oh. of the Russians run around towards Not Charles. Charles are lovers. No, one of them grabs you and starts pulling you into near our own where they proceed to beat and torture you. Well, torturing your corpse. But does that mean they've ripped our ghost out of our body? <laughs> 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 they've ripped um, ghost back into the air? It's a I did not torture you. And then let's just say that. Your angels and motion them to stop. Charles was useful, Charles. That he became a loose end. Now you are going to meet the president. <laughs> and um, and kill him. No. Fair enough, because Charles wanted to. We we're going to use Charles to be the uh, the president, right? Charles is going to yes. be yes. But now he's dead. The Russian look at his other nod. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Now then, let's see how much you're willing to sacrifice for the cause of the motherland. Walk into oh my god, it. How does it know the motherland? Very rare computers and monitors. It's crazy. Uh, so, we, I think if we stop for Yuri, we, we can bring this one to place. Maybe. Um, you. Laser. <laughs> There's always a space laser. Gotta be space laser. <laughs> Target the Kremlin. You don't disarm the nukes. I will set it to fire. No! <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I won't need to touch anything. Good, good. Now I'm going to turn on the computer system and start monitoring it. And just sit tight while I do this. You sit there and wait patiently and you begin tapping with the keyboard. <laughs> Alright. After a few minutes, he stops and says, Okay, I think I've got it now. Let me try again. Go ahead, you say. He taps the keys once more and then says, This should work. He turns to your knots. I love the knowledge. Yeah. Take context. out your gun and shoot you. You still have a your gun and you're What are you waiting for? Shoot! You're ready to hand defended. No, no, sorry, but I can't do that. <laughs> All your fault. You set me up with Charles at that dinner. I just wanted to learn Russian. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think that's about fair. How much time you got left? Uh, well, I've got, I'm gonna have to go for dinner soon, so about 25 minutes. Alright. That, that's why you didn't tell me about it. You knew I would find out of it, and you wanted to keep me from getting too close to the truth. <laughs> yes, I think we're heading towards a conclusion here. Yes. <laughs> that's why you had me kill my own husband. 
Do you know what I mean? Nope. Well, yes. And now you finally found out who I really am, and that's why you're going to pay for what you did to me. Ooh, this, is, this has been a good story, actually. Yes. <laughs> Much more coherent than the ghost of Mary Margaret. Yes, <laughs> that was very weird. I'm not afraid of you anymore. I'm going to keep... <laughs> in the kneecap, we should have said. You pull the trigger and shoot Yuri in the chest. He drops, his body drops lifeless to the floor. You Ooh. stand up and salute before walking over to Charles. Thank you for saving my life, Charles. Yeah, yeah, we both know it wasn't our fault. Who said that second bit? Was it the ghost of Charles? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was He's Charles. By the collar and shaking my knee. Shut up! What the hell are you doing? You got a, You could have shot me instead. Charles shakes his head slowly. No, I couldn't have done that. I swear. If Charles isn't dead. Um. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> yes. Charles, patient of me. No! I think it's the only course of action right now. No! We should say I thought you were dead. Feels alright. You feel like you belong here with him. You feel like you're one of the family now. This whole mess is over. Let's run away together. <laughs> <laughs> you look into Charles' eyes and say, Let's go back to our lives. We'll get through this together. Charles looks down and smiles. Yeah, let's do that. You walk to the door, towards the door while kissing each other goodbye. Well, Why I, th I, think, I think that's a good place to end it. What do you think? I think so too. I, I'm absolutely loving this. We <laughs> Wow, that, that, that was real twist and turn. I didn't really know where that, where that was yeah. going to go. Yes. Should we do this again tomorrow? Could you if you're up for it, if you're not busy? Yes, yes. Um, I, what, what, I, what I like about this is you can throw your own stuff in, but like you don't really know what's going to happen. Like, like like the whole stuff with the CIA director and and like the, the kissing is, uh, especially. Yes, that, that, was, uh, that was wild. No. Did not expect that. Yeah. Um. And and I I I, I was really with it a bit more like um I I let the AI write more. So so like when there was a line um that that ended without a quote, I, I thought well let's let the AI uh, continue. And there was a few things that didn't make sense, but like. Um, As it that was quite quite cool, though, wasn't it? it um. It was still quite well written and better than a lot of books that I've read in my life. <laughs> yes, Look, like like um, at, at the very beginning it said we will take over the world with our military might, um, and then you know bit by yeah. bit that the the story kind of evolved. It's also interesting because you kind of decide your own your own path. Yes. So what I like, I, it's what kind of what I like about it is that there's no set way, but you also don't decide everything. So it's not just you talking to a computer. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, and, and, and I like how we brought Yuri in at, at the end to like tie everything up. Yes. <laughs> I'm thoroughly enjoying this. Yes. Yes. Um, yeah, I, 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 you know, the, the, the whole thing with, with the Russians, like we were spying, we went to spy and, and like Charles made me part of his scheme but Charles is actually working with Yuri and <laughs> like like a lot of a lot of this stuff like it, it, it's kind of like we we're running a story with the AI. Yes. Yeah, no, I, we're not fully in control, but we're also we're just agents as well, aren't we? We're just agents of the story. Yeah, yes. Um, no. Yeah, and I, I, 
I, re I really enjoy, especially with bars, bars with like the, the low level thug, it's like, god damn it bars, what have you done this time? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I, 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 I know, I know that like, I, I would be very interested to know how this is actually work, because you, you, you notice that at certain times in a sense, they go and they look at the computer, like, like, it, it, it's very, it's got a very kind of Cold War vibe to it. Yeah, like, I don't know, I, I don't imagine it's open source, what do you reckon? I, I imagine it's probably like a, a well-kept secret, the software. Um, yeah, the, the GPT-2 um, is accessible, but, but like, I don't I don't know so much about the AI dungeon that uses, that uses the thing. So, yeah. So, so we'll, we'll have the thing, but, but that, that was real, real twists and turns, I, I, I think even better so than than the, the, the Mary Margaret could like we didn't even know she was a ghost until like halfway through yeah <laughs> it would have been useful information to know for sure <laughs> yeah. um but but uh yeah it, 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 it was quite interesting remember we were trying to get to the CIA's office and they, and they kept on shooting at us yes I'll, 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 I would give this a, a, a 10 out of 10. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Okay, I'm going to go and have dinner. All right. Uh, well, well, well thank, you, thank you for joining me and thank you for for the three people who stuck around to, to watch the end of this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're the, the reason. I've been chatting to people on the Discord as well. They seem happy. I'm not sure if they're listening, but yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. We've got at least three listeners. Yes. Okay, talk to you tomorrow. Yes. Take her on. Bye. Bye. And.